and welcome back to SoFlo Dining, South Florida's premier dining blog. I'm Chef Dan. This is Doris with a D. Hi. Hi. How you doing? I'm doing good. Good. <laughs> uh, this week we're going to talk to you about Angelo Elias uh, Pizza Bar and Tapas located in Coral Springs. Welcome back. Welcome back. Yeah. So how did we find this place? Uh, this place, okay, this was an interesting story. Um, the series that we just recently did, the uh, Pizza Shop series, mm -hmm. somebody had written in one of the people that follow us mm -hmm. and recommended them as, you know, to be part of the pizza series. Okay. So when I did our research that I normally do and, and check out the places, mm -hmm. I saw this was much more than a pizzeria. This definitely was more than a pizzeria. Mm -hmm. So I decided to put it on our rotation for places that we do the vlogs. Awesome. So Awesome. Thank you very much for the recommendation. Thank you. And it's very important that we get recommendations because this is how we find places. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And there was plenty of parking there. So plenty that's that's awesome. And and what area is it that it's located in? Um, it's like the border of Co uh, Coral Springs and... Parkland? Parkland, yeah. Okay. It's, it's like right on the border. It's really okay. close. Okay. And you got to tell these people about the, our first impressions and the seating. Oh, wow. Okay. First impression. <laughs> All right. Um... We, we've done uh, over 200 of these now, I think. <laughs> um, uh, this is the first time I can remember that uh, we had a server stand in there, open the door for us, yeah. and um, was, they opened the door, greeted us, mm -hmm. and right there is the, the podium or front desk, and they greeted us. Immediately. Immediately. Yeah. They took our reservation, checked us in, and brought us right to our table. Mm -hmm. um, again, first impression, no sooner did we sit down, the bread came over, the water came over, um, our waiter uh, mm -hmm. came, gave us the supplemental menu. Right, right. So, there was a lot of friendly faces. Yeah, you <laughs> got a lot of friendly faces. Um, excellent teamwork, excellent teamwork. Yeah, it was like magic. Yeah. Yeah, it was, it was a big dance that you could see just going on, a big service dance, yeah. and uh, we were the beneficiaries. Yeah. It was really, yeah. really nice. And what about the menu options and their variety? Menu options, mm -hmm. uh, a lot of, this is not an overwhelming menu, um, but there is a lot of stuff to choose from, a little bit of something for everybody. Mm -hmm. um, and and like, like I said to you earlier, is uh, a lot of the Italian restaurants you go to, they got the veal parm, the veal marsala, yeah. the veal saltimbocca, the veal piccata, and then you go to chicken and it's the identical stuff. Um, yeah. he, here, it's not like that. Um, here, it looks like they crafted certain things made them good and that's what's on the menu yeah and again there's something for everybody there it's only the best of the best and how original are they um to their identity very yeah very original um like you said you felt like you were in rome oh yeah you know i really and, did i felt like i was in italy that the sounds the yeah. the smells um the aromas obviously um but uh, most of all the uh, the ambiance that was created right. was very loving it, no. it was veramente yeah, right. italiano. And from my point, from my point of view, is you, mm -hmm. you could take that menu and put it up against about a hundred other menus, and it's not the same as anybody. No, it's, it's not. Very original. Even their drinks are original. So no, no, absolutely. We were going to talk about the drinks next, but being that you were talking about the food, can we talk about the appetizers? Because we we went over the appetizer menu quite a bit, and we went back and forth with it. Okay, the appetizers that we had. Yes. We had the uh, grilled octopus uh -huh. and the frito misto. Right. Frito misto we had somewhere else um, not too long ago and loved it, so we mm -hmm. ordered it here. Mm -hmm. um, it's kind of like if you don't know what it is, like I said to you in our in our warm ups, it's kind of like a fried calamar on steroids, <laughs> because you got the fried calamar, you got mm -hmm. fried shrimp, right. and assorted vegetables that are fried, and it's all mixed together, mm -hmm. and it comes with a, a little tangy sauce. Mm -hmm. um, again, excellent. Everything was perfectly fried. Calamar was tender. Mm -hmm. um, nothing. It was not greasy. Mm -hmm. um, just tell them about the grilled octopus. You know you want oh, to. Oh, the grilled octopus. That was the highlight of the evening for me. <laughs> um, okay. A lot of places you go, you got grilled octopus. That, octopus, they give you a little bit of lettuce or, um, I don't know, uh, garlic bread. Mm -hmm. Here, it was presented over like a little salad mm -hmm. with some pickled onions, um, hummus, 
and then a chickpea salad all together. Right. And, and they, they call it sassy? Yeah. What is it? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. And, um, and um, it was, I mean, it was delicious. And at one point I took some of the pickled onion and put it with the octopus. Yeah, it was over. That was it. That was it. I was like, wow, this is the way to eat it. <laughs> yeah, that right? I mean, you, you tried it too and you were like, okay. Yeah, yeah it was definitely over. <laughs> yep. o over and above what yeah, we yeah, had expected. Yeah. And and their drinks, the drinks. were absolutely uh, on point. Uh, it doesn't suffice. It no. doesn't suffice. I, I, it really wrote, doesn't. I wrote in the blog what I write. It was a mixologist a true masterpiece. Mixologist masterpiece. They they were I mean, they were like yeah. masterpieces. They came over to like works of art. Yeah, I, I had the Tito's refresher which features the, the Tito's vodka with uh, Saint Germain elderflower, mm. uh, fresh lime and muddled cucumber and basil and it was um <laughs> it was absolutely so refreshing. Yeah. It was, it was very a, refreshing. Like you said fresh summer drink yeah like a summer absolutely. drink absolutely right? and you ordered the angelo's old fashioned which is made with uh, the the uh, billet bourbon yeah and the aromatic bitters and that the was so refreshing i had too fresh lemon yeah, super refreshing and blackberry i left refreshed and the garnishes the oh garnishes. yeah the bing cherry oh yeah. yeah absolutely amazing um they they were both delicious um i mean i, I was blown away yeah i'll be honest and it takes quite a bit to impress me so um yeah this place really left a yeah, very original. good impression very original um yeah yeah because the drinks the service the poor i mean it was just <laughs> absolute perfection um the food and the presentation yeah, but even the service even the bartender brought over the first round of drinks yeah you know i mean yeah. it, it's just like teamwork yeah it's just, food and presentation yeah yeah, yeah like the um, flavor the portion sizes you know all right well well, okay, we'll go with the, the way everything was was actually played it beautifully, all so, the courses. Uh -huh. um, you had the a short rib special with the fettuccine. Mm -hmm. um, and I thought I was amazed uh, at the al dente fettuccine, which is something that's very hard to do. Mm -hmm. But it was. It, but it was Definitely delicious. Was. The, the balance in your sauce, the sauce was not greasy. It was... Um, nice good very delicate not not too acidy right, right. um and i went well i well, was stuck well the you. short rib was short rib, this short rib like was like big. a baseball no bone it was like a baseball all meat um <laughs> delicious yeah melt in your mouth deliciousness and for me i had a problem ordering Mm -hmm. because um i wanted what was that well, you were torn you had three different entrees in mind you oh, had the, the rigatoni bolognese the yeah. the linguine vongole mm -hmm. and, and the the veal milanese so, so we asked um alicio the server our server our server to pick one and to surprise me i don't want him to tell me what it was just pick one of those three bring uh -huh. it over uh -huh. so go ahead you can uh, his impeccable taste came back with the veal milanese the veal milanese which uh, excellent choice um mm -hmm. it was crispy crispy uh fried S perfectly very S tender right um, served with mixed greens the salad was not overdone you know not not overly dressed and it was tossed in a reggiano vinaigrette yeah which you said perfect. was absolutely perfect not overdone not drenched in it um i mean how was my my plate what, what did my plate look like when i was done it was clean clean did not need to go to the dishwasher. It was absolutely I mean, it was perfect. Clean. It was yeah. amazing. Yeah. Yeah. Well, everything was that delicious. Um, and uh, we had to order the, uh, the was, dessert. Uh, yeah. There was the... Uh, to go. To go. Yeah. The cheesecake to go, which we can't and, tell you about it because that was last night and we're going to have it probably after we tape this. So <laughs> maybe you'll hear about it in the future. <laughs> It looks delicious, though. Oh, I, I will say that uh, we were just way too full to even think about having it there. We wouldn't have been able to appreciate it. All yeah. in all, everything was on point. All in all, everything was on point. Uh, we will be back because there was a lot of stuff that we wanted to try. I mean, yeah. you saw it. There was three entrees I had to choose from, so I got to go back and have the other two. Mm -hmm. There was uh, a couple appetizers that we were looking at that yeah. we didn't get. I'm still wanting that broccoli, broccoli rob. Broccoli and, rob, and, um, the veal meatballs. Yeah, the sausage. Um, 
there was a lot of stuff on there that, that, that we're going to be back for, for yeah. sure, without a doubt. Absolutely. Absolutely. What was your overall impression? Overall impression? Uh -huh. I, I mean, I loved it. I put, I'm putting this right up there in our top ten. Okay. Um, the, the, mainly the service, the, the, oh, and the food. All the food came out piping hot. <laughs> Everything was hot. Yeah. Everything was hot. So, I mean, the service, the food, the presentation. I mean, it's a home run all the way around. It's it's perfection. It's yeah. that's all it is. I mean, I I can't think of any other word that really and truly suits them other than oh, loving perfection. And we we go to I mean, we've been to a lot of Italian restaurants that that we really like. Mm -hmm. But um, I'm I'm putting this one right up there, top ten, easily, easily. <laughs> what are your recommendations before we go? Recommendations. Mm -hmm. um, the, the the grilled call the grilled uh, octopus for <laughs> sure. Right. Um, I, I'm. I'm going to say anything on that menu is probably going to be good. I'm going to agree with you. I mean, I was looking around at other people's dishes. Yes, and, yes. And, and yes. everyone had a smile. Everybody was smiling and it all looked good. Yeah. Yeah. It was all about the love for sure. So my recommendation, like I said, is the uh, grilled calamar. Mm -hmm. um, anything else? And, and go off and go frequently. <laughs> because it's a, it's a lot of stuff. Yeah, make a reservation. Make arrive reservations, early. arrive early. Yeah. Yeah, plenty of parking, but you know, fills up fast, so yeah. it's good to get there early. Yeah. Um, yeah. Anything else to add? No, I think I'm good. So, as always, enjoy, and I'll see you there. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Check us out YouTube, Facebook, MeWe, Rumble, Tumble. But check what us else? out. Truth, truth <laughs> Social. Um, where else? We're everywhere. We're everywhere. Yeah. Look us up. SoFloDining.com. That's the main site. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, so Just letting care. you know where all the good food is. Yep. So take care. Take care. Bye. Till Bye. then.